this is the real Tom Rose, and we're solving an angles problem here. Now, this particular problem has the potential to become quite confusing. We're, we're given a whole bunch of information. I'm not even sure I can list it all, because it's mostly in the picture. But we're asked to find A. And we want to find it A in terms of B. And if you go into the answer choices, you'll know all the an notice all the answers have Bs in them. Now one tool that we can use to try to keep this from getting way too confusing is pick a number for B. We're not given one, so I'm going to pick something that looks like it could be reasonable. I'm going to put 300 in for B. I'm picking this number so that when I subtract 135 from 300, I get something which is conceivable, which is 165 for that angle right there. And we can now we can use rules of triangles and angles to our advantage. So now, this particular angle and that angle, since they sum to form a line, must equal 180 degrees. So 180 is equal to, and let's call this angle x, 180 is equal to x plus 165. And then we can solve that to show that x equals 15. Now we can do the same thing over on this angle, which is 135 plus, and say we'll call that y, equals 180. Subtract 135 from both sides to show that y equals 45. And now you can solve for a using the rule that sum of the angles in a triangle equal 180. So 45 plus 15 plus a must equal 180. And if you subtract 45 and 15, from both sides, what you'll find out is that A is equal to 120. Now we're not done, because we assumed that B was 300. So now what we have to do is plug 300 into the, each of these answer choices and figure out which one equals 120. Well, A is far too large, 300 plus 45. Um, 300 minus 45 is what, 255? That's still way too big. Um, B is 300 plus 180. That's way too big. 300 minus 180 is 120. And bingo, we've got our answer. Just check E just to be sure, 180 minus 300 is negative, so that's off. And that's how we figure it out. If you want, you could do this all with variables, by the way. Instead of 300, everywhere I have a 300, just use a B. And you could solve it that way, but I find it to be more confusing.